Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how um, WordFast Classic version 6 looks and feels when used in uh, Word 2011 on a Mac. Uh, but first, some information about uh, my setup. Uh, I have a MacBook Air running Snow Leopard. Uh, it has um, a Core 2 Duo CPU and 4 gigabytes of RAM. My version of Word is uh, 2011 and it's the latest uh, version 14.1.4 available at this time in uh, February 2012. I'm going to install WordFast Classic and uh, this is done by selecting tools, templates and add-ins. I have to add the WordFast template which is located uh, in uh, WordFast folder. Here it is, open. Now I can click on OK, and I should see the WordFast icon here. I click it, and I get the toolbar. It's quite fast, as you can see. I'm going to set up. First, check the version that I'm using. It's uh, version 6.02U which is a beta version and uh, I'm going to create a new TM uh, I'm going to translate from Finnish so FI-FI -fi into let's say British English ENGB I'm going to save the TM and I will save it here I'll give it uh, well, this name is OK. I'll add F-I-E-N. Save. OK. I now have a TM. Now I'm going to open uh, the document I want to translate. File, open. And it's in Documents. And I'll take this one. I'll now rename it uh, to Ian Uncleaned and I'll start a translation session in the first segment here. I'm a very fast typist as you, as you can see. I move to the next segment, Alt down, and again translate it. Move to the next segment. It's very fast to move from one segment to the other. And one more. And this is the last segment. All down. End of translation. Thank you for using WordFast. That's OK. I can save it. And I'll save it uh, with the final name. File, save as. And I'll delete uncleaned. OK. Now I can clean that document, so set up tools, here it is, clean up, update translation memory, yes, no, okay, yes. So here is my cleanup report. And if I move to my document, here is my clean document. So, very fast compared to previous versions of uh, Word for Mac.